I'm at Braxton Bryan. I'm in Section 6 in MTA East Sydney. And today I'm going to be doing the Graduate Cylinder Lab Technique. So, in order to begin, you're going to want to choose the right size cylinder for the amount you're measuring. Uh, and smaller graduated cylinders tend to be more precise. So once you have your cylinder and you have your liquid, you're going to want to get down to eye level so you can get a better view. And then you're going to want to take a dark object like this and you're going to want to place it behind the graduated cylinder so you can clearly see the meniscus. And then we're going to want to measure and you're going to see that each of the large lines represents about one milliliter and the smaller lines represent 0.2 milliliters. So knowing that, we're gonna measure, and we see that it's about between four and five milliliters, and then we see that it's about at the one, two, and between the third smaller line, so it's about 0.4, and then we're gonna to wanna to have to estimate the thousandths place. So we're gonna say that it's about four point for five, since it's between the second and third smaller tick. So we have about 4.45 milliliters here. And then once we want to transfer, we're going to take our graduate cylinder and put the spout on the lip of the beaker, and then we're going to just pour.